Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday, March 31st, 2024, Easter Sunday. Happy Easter, everybody. Um, I've already posted a couple of videos so far this morning. I did a walk through the woods this morning, uh, a little two mile loop through the woods, and it was really nice. My legs are hurting right now. I wasn't expecting that, but I'm probably, uh, probably have a little bit of inflammation since I cheated over the last couple of days and that wasn't very smart, but uh, you know, it's just one of those things that you gotta get through. Um, I'm, I just left Cracker Barrel. Uh, we, my wife and I ordered breakfast um, and I can't stand where we are as a society. And I'm guilty of this most of the time, just like everybody else is, but you know, I was standing in line. We did a call-in order. They said it'll be 20 minutes. I got there in 20 minutes, and it took another 25 minutes. So I'm standing around waiting. Um, and then there's some other people waiting to get their orders, too. And, you know, everybody just doing this with their phones the whole time. Everybody but me. And, look, I do it, too. But everybody just scrolling through their phones the whole entire time. They can't wait on their food without scrolling through their phones. Now, I've made a conscious effort to try to reduce the amount of time that I'm on my phone, and most of the time it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes I'm that person with their face down on their phone, and it's I'm trying not to be like that. But it's just amazing that so many people, are, they, they can't get their face out of their phone. They just can't do it. And I blame that for the health epidemic, health epidemic that a lot of people are facing these days with being overweight, with being, you know, not metabolically healthy. It's a combination of you can't get your face out of your phone and because you're, you can't get your face out of your phone, you don't get any exercise. So, I mean, you can tell, you can just look at most people, <clears throat> if they're doing that crap out in public, you know that when they're at home, they're doing the same thing all the time. And it's just, I don't know how necessary it is. We got along fine without, you know, cell phones before. But Jesus Christ, people, if you can't go to Cracker Barrel and wait for your food without having to be all in your phone like that, I mean, that's bad. That's really bad. So, you know, not only are a lot of people out of shape, and look, I'm not down on anybody that's out of shape. I'm out of shape myself. Um, so, you know, but it's the ones that are so addicted to their phones and so addicted to their standard American diet. That's that's when I say, okay, you know, both of these things is going to kill you one day. Both of these things are going to kill you one day. And it's just, how do you tell somebody that? How do you tell a stranger that? Dude, put your phone down or else you know, you're going to get fatter and then you're going to die. The whole thing is just disgusting. And like I said, I'm that person myself. I am that person myself. Sometimes if I'm waiting for something, I'll scroll through and see what's going on. Um, but I was there for 25 minutes and literally three people who had got there before I did. I don't know how I got my food before they did, but three people that were there the entire time that I were there, they didn't take their, they didn't take their face out of their phone like once. And I'm like, Jesus Christ, are you living at all? Are, are, what kind of life do you have where the, this is what you do when you're out in public? You know, hey, remember when people watching was a thing? Well, apparently people watching is not a thing anymore. Apparently your phone watching is the only thing that, that people have going on. It's insane. The, like, there were a ton of young people in in Cracker Barrel today, and they're just mm, mindless. You see parents with their kids in restaurants, and to get them to behave, they put a screen in front of their face. They put a phone, a, a tablet, you know, anything in front of their face. 
in order for them to calm down and be good. And, you know, it, everybody's a zombie now and it's gross. And I don't think that it was an intended consequence of cell phones. I don't think, you know, anybody had any idea that Facebook would be out on your mobile phone, you know, Twitter, X, whatever. YouTube, I don't think anybody thought that. I don't think it's, I don't know how deliberate it is, but Jesus, people, get your face out of your phone. Go outside, go do something. Read a book, do anything. That really hit me today, it, it really did, because, you know, I'm, I'm making the effort, and I understand, you know, so, so many people are just so caught up in what's going on on Facebook or whatever. Everybody's so caught up on it. Um, I get it. I've been that dude before. Um, gosh, I'm not going to be anymore. I'm going to keep my face out of my phone as much as I can. Please, everybody else, keep your face out of your phone. Do something. Do, do, do any. Clean your house up a little bit if it needs to be clean. Read a book. Go for a walk. Look at some... Uh, I don't know. Just do something. Stop scrolling. 